Alright guys, uh, welcome back to my latest video. Um, in this video we're going to be reviewing the uh, FAL OSW on Black Ops 2. This is a semi-automatic assault rifle on Black Ops 2 um, and it's pretty much kick-ass. I tried this um, when I wasn't prestiged and because I know it's been good in previous cards like Modern Warfare 2 and I honestly didn't like it and I thought I'll give it another go and I've just tried a couple of games with it and I absolutely adore it. Um, thrown on the reflex site and um, the I don't know the attachment that brings up the aim quicker I think it's quick draw yeah quick draw that's it and it just I just absolutely obliterated with it as you will see in this video and um, the rate of fire uh, for semi-automatic default is 515 rounds per minute so if you've got if you can click really fast or trigger click really fast on Xbox then you can um, pretty much have run around with a sort of semi-automatic overpowered sniper rifle even though it isn't a sniper rifle. The damage multiplier is the only stats I have for this gun is that it's 1.2 times in the head and the damage can range from 40 to 55 um, so it takes say about 2 to 4 bullet shot depending on where you shoot in the uh, on the body. You start off with a clip of 25 um, and have 75 to reload to. Uh, which is really really good. The recoil is extremely low especially with the foregrip attachment which I actually wasn't using in this video so it should give you an accurate representation um, of the recoil on it without any attachments to lower it down and it's even better with it on so I would highly suggest that you were to do it. Now the reason the range is 55 to 40 is because at range it drops off at about 60 meters um, the damage goes down to 40 but at the at a range of about zero to fifteen, you get a, a damage of fifty-five. So you you see like a really nice free uh, triple kill in this game. That's really good montage clip possibly. But it's a really really good assault rifle. I would highly recommend Reflex Sight or any other sight of your choice. And quick draw is pretty much a necessity because you need to be able to pull up your weapon quickly when you see someone around the corner. But most of the time, it is a two-hit kill and it is a, an awesome gun. And I would highly recommend it to anyone who has a good trigger finger. I will practice in a private match before um, doing this on public matches though because it can be difficult to get used to. But once you get that trigger action um, sorted, it can effectively be better than just a normal assault rifle, a normal automatic assault rifle. Um, the reload time is normally 2.09 seconds and the from empty it's 2.7 seconds. The stats will be up on the screen now. Uh, for any of you who want to look into it more or a link in the description will be put there as well. If you guys like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up. Um, the next gun review will be coming tomorrow. I have not decided as of yet which gun review I'm going to do. Um, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to start trying to do some guns that aren't as well known but are really good. That's the whole purpose of these gun reviews. They could simply just go and do a Type 25 review. But everyone knows that everyone uses the Type 25 or the MP7 or the Vector. So I'm trying to do these guns that aren't as more well used to try and get people using them and realize their full potential. Anyway, um, I will hopefully see you guys in the next video. Like this if you, thumbs it up if you like this video. And subscribe if you want to see more content from me. Thanks for watching and I shall see you guys next time.